Guard up, broski. No. Guard up, broski. You gotta show me the shoot. Can't do it again. Nah. <laughs> Yo. No way. No way. You want to know what my new personal mission is? What's that? To make you the greatest official possible. That's awesome. I really feel like you are my science project. Not to compare you to a science project. Because you're more than that. Because I don't want to be Frank and stuff. Right. <laughs> but I just, I really. It'll be like, oh, oh I'm sure I'm brave. I look forward to. So really seeing how, how far we could take this with you. Right. So I literally have, I'm gonna keep it real simple. I have like 10 signals, 10 file calls, uh -huh. and I just wanna go through each one and um, just see how you do it and see if we could tweak anything or sharpen anything up. Let's, let's start simple, stop the clock. Stop the clock, stop the clock. Stop the clock. I mean, that's pretty much as straight as you can. I like that your thumb is tucked too. I love it. Because I see guys that go up with the open hand, yeah. which is actually a, a girl's mechanic. Oh. Um, that, that's simple. Just, I like to tuck yeah. the thumb. And one thing I struggle with is getting my arm straight up. That's a lot of times I, I see myself on camera, like when I'm calling a foul, it just mm -hmm. feels a little, like an L. Mm -hmm. and I'm like, oh, I gotta get it up high. Yeah. So that was good, good height and oh, look straight. I was once told when you call a foul, Key thing to keep in mind is just punch the sky. Hmm. Yeah, punch the sky. Simple. Simple, right? Simple feedback. I like it. Punch the sky. I'm going to use it. <laughs> All right, so let's go stop the clock into your chop. Chop. Clock and stop. Chop. Let's see again. Clock and stop. Chop. Right. I don't want it too outward. So we will. Like I want it to finish. You know what I, I do? Derek Jeter. The Der I call it the Derek Jeter fist pump. You know, when he used to... Okay. In a big like spot, that. he used to always go like that. I like, think that looks great. Right. And it's still like a 90 degree angle. So you go in here, boom, and just pop boom. the fist. Pop Perfect. the whole ball. I like how you finish strong with that pop. Pop the pop. fist. And pop my, the fist. My chop, my chop in has changed over the years. In the book, there's really no specific chop. It's just more of a dropping of the hand. Yeah. I used to do this, chop with the two fingers. Then I just evolved to just the, just the chop here. Oh, that, that just looks the best. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Game on. Some, guy, some guys chop with the fist like out here. Some guys chop with the whole hand. I just think this, the Jeter fist looks the strongest. I, I actually started chopping with the whole hand. Going in. Yeah! Look, look, look. This is hibachi. Round one, fight. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what it is. Right, so yeah, I like the fish pop. Head is up. Ooh, keep it simple. Yeah. All right, um, let me see your hand count. Hand count. Call up the court, 10 seconds. Anywhere. Anywhere. Where oh. are you going? Don't, don't go oh. too far. All right, right here, I'm good? That's great. All right, so we're going in here. Two. All right, one thing that, that looks a little robotic to me is because you just have your hand the whole time um, open. I think we close it here uh -huh. and then pop it out. Close it, pop it out. Little tweak, your, your angle is good, it's straight, your arm is straight. Close it, pop it out. Keep going, give me five. Close it, two, two, three, four, Good morning. Good morning. five. Yeah, I think the hand count your, your height is good. I see some guys, they count too low, like this. Or what about the guys that count high? Too high. That's just not my style. I like bringing that shoulder straight out. Uh, so I'm starting it at my, the middle of my chest oh, with okay. a closed fist, popping it out here. You, are you popping it in your hand? What, what do you I like mean? to keep my hand compact for some Well, that's what I just tweaked yeah. for you. I want you to finish it compact. Okay. But I want you to bring it in. Close. Yeah. Because right. I just think this looks robotic. Does this? What do you think? It does a little does. bit, right? Yes. It's just a nice transition. It creates mm -hmm. fluidity. Right. All right. So hand count looks good. Keep it at that height. All you're doing is extending your arm straight out, shoulder height. Yes. Let me see one more time. Right, here we are. Boom. Uh, no. Oh. Damn. Cheetah fist. Oh, okay. It looks just a little too careful. 
Like, just be a little more loose with it. Like, I don't know. That's, that's spot on. Right, so far, so good. Let me see your over and back, back court. Very simple. Ooh. All right, one thing I don't like, you're, you have your hand up and you're using the other hand. We don't want to look like a traffic cop. We should never have both hands up in the air. I actually took that one from the book up in there. Yeah, but it, in the book, you won't see you hit that, that stop clock up. Oh, yeah. He'll drop it, use the same hand. Oh. I'll stop with the right. Exactly. Then I'm going to do the over and back with right. the right. So let me see again. Oh, here we go. No. No. This, this is what you do. All right, gotcha. Point to the back court, point to the front court. Back court, front court. Don't move it side to side. Three times. No. We're not going side to side. Like over right. and back. Over. Right. Over the line. There you go. Move over here. Move here. That's too much, right? I just want to see it over a little bit more. Over? Yeah, over the line. Not like side to side. Over the line. Better. Just work on it. Yeah. Definitely. Boy. Let me see your point after that. So stop the clock, over and back, and then point. All right. I'm going this way. You're going this way? Yeah, so do it with the right hand. Cool. Do it with the right hand. Let me see. Oh. One more time. I'm sorry. So I'll go here. One, two, three. I want to see more of a snap with the, with the point. Better. Work on that. Yes. Work on making that more, and that, more and smoother. Thanks, because I usually don't work on that. No one practice. Like, you don't practice your head. Yeah. You practice your carry. You don't even practice your carry. No. You don't practice your double yeah. dribble. That's why we're bringing it back to basics. <laughs> No, that's a weird, I feel weird calling over and back sometimes. I just, it just feels a little awkward. It's just, I don't know, it's just not that natural. Man. When I first started, I would say back court violation. Then I just went and book and would say over and back. So I just kept using over and back. Uh, I would say back court. I would say, say back court. court. Back court. Who says over and back? I don't even know why I I'm mentioning over and back. I like over, this court, over and back. Is that what it is in the book? Yeah. Okay. So I just but it's a back court, court violation. So the signal is called over and back? No, I mean, the call is called over and back because you went over the division line and went back. You're 100% on that? Uh, yeah. Are you 100%? I, I'm going go with 98.7. If you're 98.7, then you're zero. You're zero. It's either 100 or nothing. It's 100 or zero. Okay. Because when we say we're going to bring information, we're not bringing in 98.7% information. Okay, I'll go. I'll okay, so I'll be 100. You. Don't right. tell me anything unless you're 100. I don't want to know anything that you're 98. That's official. You're right. That's right. I want your temperature to be 98.7. <laughs> <laughs> and I want your FM dial to be 98.7. Because oh. it's the um, ESPN radio. Anyway, let me see your point. Stop the clock, point direction. Stop, Stop. the clock, Stop. point the direction. Boom. Point this way. I've been watching your film, man. You point. I like that. I got it from you. How do I point? Point. But nah, you don't point like that. Don't, don't, you're revealing the finger too soon. You're revealing the finger. You stopped it, and your finger's already here. Stop it, fist it, pop it. <laughs> yeah, better. Like, I, I don't mean stop it and make a fist. I just mean, like, leave your, leave your pointer finger... Unexposed until you're moving forward with your hand. Better. Got it. It's almost like at the very end, you see the finger, like mm -hmm. the gun is shooting. Got it. One more time. Yes. Both hands. With your front foot too, I want to see you step into it. Okay. So your foot is almost is moving forward, same hand, coinciding same foot, with your hand. Same. Uh, for this call, I like same hand, same foot, finishing here, versus the punch, where I'm finishing with the opposite foot because um, it feels more like I'm throwing a, a ball. Got it. Boom. Like I feel like I would, I get crossed up if I 
Right. If I point right. opposite. Like, and just hold that for an extra second. Like, you're totally sure about the call, you're, you're confident, you're holding it. It's not like a quick point this way. Uh -huh. Hope I got the call right. Right. The longer we stay in the pocket, uh -huh. in, the, in the reporting pocket, the more confident we look in my opinion. I agree. I was watching, my, um, was watching one of my partners from a couple games ago and he just reported one foul, but it was, I, was just, I just took note because it was so quick to the table. White, 25, hit, two shots, and he's out. Where are you going? Why are you running away? I'm not saying be there 10 seconds, but you should be there four or five seconds. Good. Each signal, in my opinion, should last like almost two seconds. So white, 25, one, two. Hit, one, two. Two shots, one, two. That's the tempo I like to move at. Kick the ball. Back, back up. Back up. Yeah. Oh, the double point. The double point. The double point. Oh, you can switch it up. Yeah. In the book, it's this. But I like that you added the point. Boop, boop. Kick ball. That looks good. When we, when we point to the foot. Correct. That's just a little tip. I don't know if anybody else uses it. Okay. One foot, you might see a couple guys use it. Yeah, one or two. Opposite foot or same foot. Doesn't matter, I don't think. That's almost like you hit. Well, you can do a hit in six different ways. Mm -hmm. Kick I, have, I have 12 of them. 12 just kidding. <laughs> Alright. So um, the kick. Shot one shot. Good. I like it. Hold it. That's right. You see the trip foul. Tripping. Oh, you got me. Yeah, in high school, I don't know if that's in the book. We say but it, but, but if yeah. a guy gets tripped, we're going to report a trip. We're not going to report a hit or a push. Or no. Whatever. The yeah, pole will be so tripped up. The pole. Back up. Right. Okay. Oh, this is a foul. Wait. So, black, 15, trip. Too close to your kick. So don't point, I won't point. Don't point, you gotta Just differentiate. Right. Um, yeah, I, I would, I have more of a side to side sweeping motion. My, my kick's a little obnoxious. But as it works though, I feel like I'm doing karate. So white, 25, kicks him. I go from right to left, and I just sweep the leg. What do you think of that? I like it. You like it? I like it. Let me see you try. So here you go, white, 25. Just work on the motion. Yes. Once you drop in your hands after the you've reported, get right into the kick. <laughs> oh, I want to say. What do you got? I think uh, <clears throat> New Year's Day. I Come over up. here, bro. Uh, hey, I won't go. Let people see your beautiful head. Uh, and you shave. But don't go too far. All right. So uh, New Year's Day. I'm so into working on Mark Candles. I don't, I woke up New Year's Day, didn't get out of bed, didn't do anything. First thing I did was black, 35. While you were laying in bed? Yeah, it's just New, New Year's Day. Extending the arms out. That's some ref nerd stuff right You here. have to be, what? I'm addicted to this. I'm a referee junkie, that's it. Nice, too bad you didn't have a mirror on your ceiling. That's so. Um, Aha, light bulb moment. I like that. All right, what else do we have? Your girl's gonna walk into your room and see a mirror on the ceiling. Same thing there's somewhere else. I wanna see your three point signal. Perfect. Three point signal. Boop. And it came three. Now bring it down here. Nah. Nah. What is this? So you wanna go up here? My philosophy on a three point make is we should look like an NFL referee who is signaling a made extra point or field goal. And how does that look like? Like the goal post. Like the goal post. Like the goal post. Like Make goal your post. three point signal like a goal post. No. What is this? Nah. Well, Get it up. Right here? Yeah. And move up straighter with your arms. Better. Better. I always thought the goal post looked like this. Okay, maybe it does, but I, okay. I want this to be high. <laughs> All right, here we go. And then you should bring the other arm up. 
Drop it below. Let me see it again. Hold it up. Keep it up there. Mm -hmm. Like that. Keep that. Hold that. That's perfect. That's yeah, perfect. I'm trying you're to You're big, you're strong, you're tall. Stay big. When you went here, you got small. So that's great. I see guys that do it too narrow. I see guys that have their hands out. Like it, it's just, I think it's, just keep it simple. Look like an NFL referee when, he, when, he, when we have a field goal. Like this. A little bit high. Yeah, yeah, that's where you want to be. Right around that zone. Right. And are you going to tuck your finger? Are you going to tuck your thumb? Or are you going to keep your thumb out? Tuck my thumb. Either way. Always. But make sure your, your, you know, your hands are here and not, I don't want to see palms. No. I don't want to see the back end. It's uh, straight. So, so. No. No. You, can't, you got lower. You're, you're at a right angle. It should mirror that. It should mirror the attempt. Just mirror the attempt. Better. Now, I just want to point out, this is not the correct three-point attempt signal. Yes. Three by eight. However. Right, because I was told I did that one time. The other gentleman, uh, he was like, how are you going to see that? How am I supposed to see that if you're the lead? This? How are you? How I know, you, I know, I agree. When you have 6'11", 6'7", I, I, on the court. I, I agree. You know? That's why I'm not doing this. I, I, mean, I started off doing that. He was like, how am I, I going to see that? I never, I never went out to the side like this. But actually, in the book, it really does look like this. Yeah. I, I went up with my three. Uh-huh. I mean, you see NBA guys, this is what they do in the NBA. That looks the best, in my opinion. But, but in a sense, to communicate with our partner, because we, as officials, <clears throat> we speak our primary language, however, but on the court, we speak sign language. So, I need to communicate with you as a lead. Uh, player takes the three from the corner. You might not be able to see me, especially mm -hmm. from my yeah. head. So, I go up, especially since I have a long arm. Mm -hmm. You can see that real quick and I get back to the body that I need. Okay. When I'm at the top, I would just, I don't, I don't do, I just eradicated this from my vocab about like, from my game for about four weeks ago. Signal combination here. Show me a three point attempt into a foul, into a made three, and then report it at the table. Love it. Where are you going? He's always going somewhere. You have so many like lead ups today. <laughs> All right, anyway, form indicated. I might wait, to, wait for the play to finish. Wait for the play to finish. Boom. You got the foul. Got the foul. Boom. All right, I'm wait, but I'm staying with the play. I'm right. holding on. Hold on. Right here. Right here. So say you see me here at home. They fall. Let the bodies fall. Wait. All right, fine. I'll drop over. No, there you go. I'm going to you the table. You, you didn't correctly signal how many points we scored on the spot. We, had, we just hit a three-point goal. Excellent. So all you did was signal attempt and, and signal foul. Stop doing this. Get up. All right. You are big and tall and large. Be big. All right, here we go. Ooh. Ooh. Now run over to the table. Hold it for a second. Hold it. Attempt, boop, foul, make, on the spot. Hold in it. Let everybody know the basket's good. Go ahead, take me, take me from there. Attempt, foul, attempt, boop. Report to the table. table. Award flow. Whoa. This guy is flushing from up here. You gonna flush from up here? I'm tall, long, so. No, too much. Too much. Too much. We're not gonna start it up here. Where did you start it? Start it like I love. Like, are you are you flushing with the hand like this? That is in yes. the book. That's correct in the book. Uh -huh. Is that what you're gonna do? Yeah. Okay. But I'm using my left. The same way I start the yeah, don't, don't start the flush from here. I love. Yeah, it's just, this is too extra. This is all. I understand, and I know I told you to be big, but not on this particular. All right, so I can come over. Award the goal. All right, come over. Push it out from our level. Award the goal. 35. Okay. Okay, we're awarding what goal? How many points? 
you say award three point goal. Yeah, but how are we gonna let everybody know that it's a three pointer? I just signaled on. You just signaled on the spot. Now we're gonna go let the table know that it's a three again. So, so award the three. Score it. Score the three. Score the three. Sure. Score the goal. Score, score the three. three. All right. Score the goal. That's what I said. Award the goal. Okay. I got to go to book. Book says okay. award the goal. What else are you gonna do? Report the foul. How many points did we score? Three. So what do I say? Score the goal. Three points. Again, show them again at the table. Three points. White, 25. Push, one. I knew that. I didn't know that. I, I know. Just this that. is all. This is I Because there's a lot of layers to this call. I, I had it last night. It, this call has confused me before because there's, there's four diff five different things to do. Right. You just got to take your time and go step by step. Attempt. Foul. Three points. Good. Going to the table. Doing the same thing. Score the goal. Three points. White, 25. Push. One shot. Attempt. Woo. Three. Score the goal. Three points. White, 35. Hit. One shot. Clean. Thanks. Take that. Practice it. You have to practice that one. That was brand new. Mm -hmm. What else we got? Carry. So. Palmy. Whoop. Palm violation. That was two. Quick. You only did one. It should be three. Should be three? Yeah. Got it. I already said it. Whoop. That was two, I think. One, two. Okay. One, two, two one, three. Two. I feel like I'm doing this two. Just for a palm violation? Three times? Four? <clears throat> Slow the game down, right? Is that time? There needs to be a better transition from your carry to the point. It's got to be more fluid. I want to see more of a um, pop on the point, like a load up, like a bow and arrow load up. Uh -huh. Same concept with the point. You're, you're coming towards your body to go that way. It's going to give it more pop. Science or art, science or art or both. You had a good lead up. I didn't like your finish. Softer? No, harder. Okay. Pop it. Better. Pop it. Everything should be sharp and strong. At the finish. Yeah, yeah, at the finish. You want to finish with, make it jump off the page. You good job. You said you good. Mm. One, two, three. Better. That's strong. my dominant strong. hand. Strong. Yeah, but make your weak hand your dominant mm -hmm. hand. Strong. Take that concept into anything that you want to improve. Mm -hmm. You have a weakness, make it your strength, your biggest strength. I'm serious. No, no. Anytime there's a, there's a weakness, I look at it as an opportunity to become a strength. Right. I agree. You know? So if your left hand is your weakest, well, I want to see your left hand be stronger than your right by next year. Okay. Like that. What else? Travel. The world famous travel. Mm -hmm. What? Did you, did you have the open hands? I, I, yes. The wheel's on the bus. Yes. Forgive me. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Go that way. You want to say straight up? Okay. Ooh. No, but you. I still. I need to see tuck, tuck fist. Tuck fist. Tuck, tuck fist. Got it. Three times. One, two, three. Into your point. Okay. Boom. Yep. Three times. Two, three. And that third one goes right into your point. So mm. one, two, three, right into it. Genius. That was two. One, two, three. Good. Keep just just remember right. that. Take take mental notes. Three revolutions. <laughs> That's what it is, right? Yes. It's a revolution. Exactly. Exactly. This is a revolution. Sure. Exactly. The basketball shot. It's just two refs on the court talking hoops. I don't think it's been done before. I don't know. I don't know. You, would, you would have to search the internet for that. <laughs> <laughs>
Right, because you have commentators who talk, players who sit down and talk. Very rarely you see officials. Officials go in the meeting. Mm-hmm. We have our pregame meeting, watch film, camera comes in, they check us out, but never us on the basketball court. It's fun. It's exciting. You having fun? I have a great time. I got one more for you. Go for it. Um, start. Wait, hold on. Got some notes. I'm just looking at. By the way, to the viewers that don't do high school or college and do like pro or women's or FIBA, you got to differentiate whatever your mechanics are. So our, our, our um, double foul might be different than your double foul, but you could still all apply everything that we're going over. So just make sure you differentiate for your organization. Mm-hmm. And that goes with rules as well when I post rules. Double dribble. Oh, one more, one more thing about the hand count. Why, why do officials do this? They hand the inbounder the ball right away, hand it, right to their one hand. That's not one second. It's well, not one second. Before I came to watch your varsity game, I would hold the hand up and then hand it over to the player. Or sometimes, um, if I'm over here, hand it over here, cross the body, and take a step back because I can do my five count away from the player. But that doesn't address the issue of starting your count too too soon. Oh. My point is I think guys start their count too soon. They're going right to the one count. If I'm an inbounder and you give me the ball and I see you count one second after point three, I'm probably going to be like, ref, that's not one second. Mm, no, I wouldn't do that. But it, it doesn't equate to you having an accurate five-second call. Here. One. By one... I'm here. After one second, my arm is fully extended. My, you know? Okay. So just, just be accurate with your count. Let me see your double dribble and then we'll call it a day. Ooh. Point this way. Ooh. I want to see a lead up with the footwork going into your point after the Ooh, right step. Right, yeah. step. Oh my God, this is amazing. Ooh. Same here. Same a little here. momentum. Cool. Build a little momentum. Like, we don't want to be all, all the time flat-footed when we're going the other way. Uh-huh. Just have a little bit of momentum to carry you that way, project a little bit more strength. So double dribble. That's an easy one, right? Yeah. Let me see one more time. I like it, my friend. Thanks. This is good. So just take what we did today and go practice it. Perfect. I'd love moment. to see your growth. Everybody else is going to see your growth, too. Because we're starting at like ground zero, you know, I want to just give you everything I have and I love that you're an information seeker and a question to ask her. Good stuff. Take care.